Today's science deniers have many required proofs, the majority of which have been quite cleanly displayed or explained. But one thing still remains, proof of bending water around the Earth due to the force of gravity. And even though it's a fact that water bends around the curvature of the Earth, as it is observed in every photo of objects disappearing from the bottom up as they move beyond the horizon, this does not seem to satisfy the skeptics. So I have designed a test. And with your help, I will be able to see this test through. This will be the solid, indisputable test to see if water, at rest, bends around the curvature of the Earth, remaining level to the center of the Earth, or if it remains perfectly straight as if level with a plane. So here's the test. If you take two plastic tubes and set them up vertically, then you connect those tubes and put water in them, the water will create a level, regardless of the tube heights or thickness. And the connecting tube can literally be at any angle. It can be bowed up, it can be bowed down, and even laid in several different directions. The water will remain level. What I will be doing is placing connected vertical tubes 100 meters apart, across 1,600 meters, or just short of a mile. This will create 17 measuring points. Then 100 meters from there, I will have a camera to look down the line of filled and connected tubes. And although the terrain might be uneven, the levels will always remain level. When looking down the line with a camera, first I will place a marker on the first and last tubes at one centimeter below the water's level. Then I will align a straight line of markers on all the other tubes in between. At the same time, 15 centimeters above each one of those markers, I will place another line of markers. These two lines will be visibly and measurably parallel with each other. Then I will place a marker at the water height on each tube and check the results. If the water levels create an arc between the two parallel lines, the Earth is curved and we can see that. If the water levels remain parallel to the two lines, then this will mean a flat plane. Make no mistakes though, across this distance, the arc will only peak about four inches. So accuracy is going to be important and good photos will be a priority. That's the entire test. The problem is travel and rather substantial material costs. Included in my funding request, there is the entire tubing assembly, a water pump, gas money, and sustenance for the day, as well as a camera. Now, since I'm not producing a product, I have to come up with something special for the optional perks in the funding of this test. So this is what I came up with. The $25 perk, your name will be placed in the drawing one time. The $50 perk, your name will be placed in the drawing three times. And I wanted to do something a little bit extra, so I came up with this. For $75, your name will be placed in the drawing four times, plus your username or an acceptable title or name of your choosing will be placed on one of the measuring tubes and will be seen as part of the test. Sound good? The funding request includes the purchase of a Nikon P900 camera because of its excellent zoom capability. This will be needed in order to get the photo of the results in the zoom clarity required. And since the P1000 came out, the price has gone down a bit on the P900, so it is a sensible purchase for this project. So let's talk about the perks. As much as I would love to keep the camera, I really have no use for it beyond this project. So I'll be giving it away by drawing a name of someone who has purchased one of the perks. This means at the completion of the test, one of you who purchased the perk will own the camera I used. But here's another thing. If we get $600 above the funding goal, then I will purchase the new P1000 camera instead of the P900. And that will become the prize of the drawing. This means you have the potential to win a $1,000 camera for 25 bucks. Any funds received beyond the funding goal or beyond the purchase of a P1000 will go towards possible future projects and videos. The drawing will be performed live on a hangout after the release of the test video. And once I'm done with the test, I will be cutting the video so it will come out quite quickly after doing the test. We have already scouted out three potential locations to perform this test here in Germany. And the test will be performed sometime in mid to late spring, or once our funding request has been reached. And I really hope for as many people to participate as possible in the funding of this project to ensure that everything goes smoothly. Feel free to link, mirror, or share this video. I only request that in the top line of your description below the video, that you please put a link to the GoFundMe page so we can hope for maximum participation. At the end of this test, it will no longer be able to be argued whether water bends around a curve, remaining level to the center of the earth, or if it remains perfectly flat. Y'all have a nice day.